Roger Federer is set to call time on his illustrious tennis career after the Labour Cup in London. Tennis icon Roger Federer has been denied his ultimate dream after reluctantly outlining his plan to retire from the sport after next week's Labour Cup in London. The 41-year-old Swiss legend, who won 20 Grand Slams during a record-breaking career that has spanned 24 years, issued a heartfelt statement confirming that had finally decided to walk away from the sport following a long battle with injuries. Federer's right knee, which has required multiple operations, has halted his involvement on the court and his painful rehabilitation has left him with no other options but to hang up his racket. Speaking to Swiss newspaper Le Matin back in November 2021, Federer was optimistic that his time at the top of the sport had not yet come to an end. There was no denying that retirement was just around the corner but the now 41-year-old superstar was adamant he wanted to feature in at least one more Grand Slam. It was a goal he set himself and one he was determined to achieve heading into 2022, just a matter of months after featuring at Wimbledon, which would eventually prove to be his last outing at a major. My ambition is to see what I'm capable of one last time. I also wish I could say goodbye in my own way and on a tennis court. That's why I give my all in my rehabilitation, a defiant Federer declared. Then let's be clear, my life is not going to collapse if I don't play a Grand Slam final again. But it would be the ultimate dream to go back. I know it will be incredibly difficult, but I do believe in these kinds of miracles. I've experienced them myself, Federer stated. I would like to find out what I can achieve on a tennis court again. It would have been easy to say, let's stop here. But they, the fans, deserve better than what they've seen from me throughout the past grass court season. Federer's lack of fitness saw him drop out of the top 50 for the first time since 2000 in June 2022. Just one month later in July. Federer dropped out of the ATP singles ranking altogether for the first time in 25 years following his debut in September 1997.